Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is your boy, Master of Random. Today I am shooting the pistol crossbow, 80 pound. This one is traveling at 200 feet per second. I'll also be shooting the Benjamin Prowler, NP2, traveling at about 650, no, 800 feet per second because it's using a lead. Now, I know you guys don't, might not be able to see it, but there's a, if you guys see that shed, there's a little bit of a, there's a square board Lane against it. Now, we're, the test is we're going to see the difference between how long it takes to reach it. So you'll be knowing the difference between what 200 feet, 200 feet per second sounds like versus 800 feet per second sounds like. Here we go. One, two, three. Hear that? All right. And then here is the Benjamin Prowler NP2. All right, let's hear that again. Load, load them first. All right. Rifle's loaded. All right, and then let's load the pistol crossbow. All now, when you're shooting at a hard targets, I would not, I don't recommend you use aluminum darts because they'll bend. They do bend. All right, we'll throw, throw off the accuracy. All right, here we go. One, two, three. There we go. There's that. And then, 600, 800 feet per second. All right. So that was that. Now, here, here is the pistol crossbow. Now, I did just get these yesterday, and I don't know why, but the strings are already falling apart. But this is an 80 pound for 200 feet, feet per second. Now, I probably made a little bit more because I had more spacers in there. The more spacers you add, the long, the further the drawback is, so it'll be more a little bit more velocity. So right now, with more spacers, I have probably got about 220, maybe 230. But... It's an auto automatic safe safety, and it's easy. You just pull, pull this piece, best this piece right here. Just pull it back, and this it'll hook. This will pull these back and locks it on. All right, and then here is the Benjamin Prowler NP2. Now you're looking at this. This is not. This is definitely not. A Benjamin Prowler. Well, that is because it, it is a Benjamin Prowler because this this up here the firing mechanism is the from the Benjamin Prowler. It's the stock here that is different. This is from the Swiss Arms TG1. This from the 177 air rifle. Now I just switched the stock because my stock broke because I was mad, I guess. And you see, what is that on it? That that this is carbon fiber. I wrapped it in carbon fiber to make it look cool and make it help help grab it a little better. I did grab the barrel as well. And I did put a little um washer towel pipe thing on there, make it look cool. But yeah, this is all that is. This is a, oh, a two by four by forty. A four by forty, I guess. Swiss arms. This is for the Swiss arms and this is a Multi mill dot. Now, when you're if you're gonna, ever gonna buy a scope, make sure you get the multi mill dot, cause there's the better, cause you can range range better and a little bit more accurate too. All right. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share. If you like this video, put a like. Put a like. If you love this video, share it. And if you want more, subscribe. Peace, y'all.